Welcome back, any lovers. Today, we're just gonna Viva Land. So, we're gonna grab your silver plate. Now, it's just the Dream House version of it. Viva Land is actually right here. It's an interesting concept. Viva Land is gonna be a game where you're going to. Uh, you're going to load into a house and kind of live your Sims life. So you're going to be basically, it's, in my opinion, it's like a multiplayer Sims game where you're going to be living your life with other people. They can have their own homes in it and you can actually build homes together and, and all this cool little zany stuff. It's it's really cool. But this, they released a dream house for this. This is so that you can check out what the building aspects are. And actually, you can download this for free and be able to build with your friends too. So... We're gonna hop in here and check the game for a little while. If you do like it, of course, please check the links down below. So yeah, you could hop on here with your friend and you guys could you guys could build the ultimate, I guess the ultimate home together. <laughs> if you guys wanna live together, this is super cool. This is beautiful right there. There's a lot to build your house on. You can have one lot per town to so invite friends to this town. Send them the town code in the top left, Indie Land. Oh, this one right here. Now I'm on, I'm on uh, streamer mode. So it did one, turn off the music and two, blocked my invite code. But this way you guys gotta, you know, everyone must claim their lot before they can build with others. Lighthouse Point is actually a spot in South Florida. Like, we actually have a place called Lighthouse Point, and it's beautiful. Here you have the power to build your house the way you want it. Get guidance from the grid and snap tools. Choose from many objects and surfaces to customize the structure and colors to match your style. Easy adjust position, rotation, curvature, and scale, or change the height of your walls. Play this tutorial and be guided through all the tools and steps to build if you prefer to skip for now. Uh, no, let's do it. Select the wall tool just in case I'm wrong. Wall tool, left click and hold. Drag and release. I mean, it seems pretty. Place the walls can be modified any ways. Left clicking it to adjust. Oh. Oh, you can just move it up. Look at, look at this. This is super cool. Hope it doesn't melt my PC. Oh, this is super cool. I wonder if you'll be able to take your character along the way. Like, I'll be able to take the boat over there and, you know. Left click on it to adjust the height, the position, or turn the whole level into a foundation. What? Oh, yeah, look at that. Change the style, select the surface, and. Oh, and you can paint it. Okay. Left click the style. Change the style, left click the surface, and. Is that a surface? Wait, there's a sur. What's a surface? Is that like, is that what that is? Is is that? Oh, surfaces. Yeah. Okay, I was right. Okay, cool. That's so weird. They should probably put that in a better lighting. Oh, look at this curved wall. What? Look at this. Yeah, like your little. I mean, that, that's a hard dent there, but whatever. You want to do or delete something? Hammer. Boom. Cool. Once you reclose the room with walls, we'll have a default floor. Okay, so let's just build a room then. Here, let's say we're going to do, if we were going to build a home here, what would be our front knob? Let's build a front one right here. How about that? View grid, perfect for placing objects. Locked camera. Oh, uh, actually, that's that's. I was thinking that was gonna be horrible, but that's actually not bad. Okay, so there's my room. What would I do with the outside us? Oh, I got some decent options here. Clean farmhouse tiles. Oh, I like that. Rustic yet. Oh, look at the little, little flower. Nah, I like the black better, actually, to be honest.
The zooming around's rough. Um, let's see here. That's the different floors. Let's customize this. Let the surface from the floor category. Okay, so we build. Oh, you click on. Oh, look at this. So there's a staircase. Oh, I like. Okay, so we're gonna destroy this whole thing. Actually, okay. This is this is cool. This is cool. So we're gonna do walls, right? Yeah. Look at all this. This is super cool. Okay, so we do this. And then what we do is we do that. So now it's a foundation. And then we could do stairs. You know? Can I like stretch these? I'd like, like, dude, that doesn't look right. There we go. I was like, wait. See, that doesn't look right, though. Ooh, I kind of like the floating stairs, actually. So, like that. Yeah, I just, I really wanted a combined staircase. Oh, oops. Oh, oops. Oh, well, we're going back to town. This is an update in real time. Let's see. It's actually a really cool thing to check out. Yeah, it does. Oh, that's cool. And your friends could be building. I wonder. This is the question, though. And, and this would be really hard to pull off. I wonder if your friends, when they pick up these, like, let's say they pick up one of these, I wonder if their lot upgrades over time. Like, if you zoom out to the thing, you see their home... You know, that'd be kind of cool, actually. Oh. All right. Sorry. Let's take a zip. The bottom of this. Do I do like old style? No, those are still. That's not bad for her. You know, I kind of miss, I used to be obsessed with The Sims, so I kind of miss playing a Sims game. I should get back into it and play one time. There's the camera thing. I kind of like that locked-in camera, so I'm not like up and down, up and down, up and down. Oh, I guess if I want, hmm. There we go. I was like, well, I wonder why the, ward, the floor disappeared. So it'll be one, two, three. Four, five, six. One, two, three, four, five. Somehow I nailed the center. I don't know how I did that. Do I have a double door? I do have a double door. I love that. Hmm. 
not a ton of door sh doors right now, but honestly, that's okay. Yes, beautiful. See, this way I have a patio. Yeah, see, so you can fence it up here. Fence tool. And you could paint the fence. This is actually the ever the best game or the best um, things to do in The Sims. I used to love building homes, man. Yeah, my favorite thing about the game was always building. And then I could what do this? Oh, that's freaking sweet. Oh, the okay. Would it be cute to have like columns here? I don't know. I don't know about that one. <laughs> Let's worry about this first. You know, maybe we'll get rid of the doors. Maybe they won't be the gothic doors. Maybe we'll do the double-sided, double-frame, industrial black. No. Oh, they gotta have more doors. This is definitely, this is chill. This is really cool, but I definitely want a thousand doors. No, ew. 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 <laughs> I'm just picking between them right now and I just like, no. That's not bad. I like the green door, but... I could build the Adams family. Oh, perfect. This is what I want. That's so plain, though. And that's ugly. Tintable wallpaper. What? Actually, a really nice color. Can you add that? I don't know, people are going to scream at me right now. They're really, that's disgusting. But I kind of like the color. Can I dig in the color? Oh, look at the alignment. I like the alignment tool. Is that a slide window? Like a door? No, that's a, that's a little too basic. Oh, I like this one. Oh yeah, I like this. This is super nice. This, this I get. This is nice. <laughs> What's that meme again? This I like. Um, that's a really just cool things here inside. A boat. 
deck. Well, first off, I'd have to... Okay, see, it's coming together a little bit. I, I, I'd have to... I'm just throwing this together, like, randomly, but... If I was going to really do it, I mean, I'd change it up. You know, I'd really invest the time into this. No. So what are we doing bold? Should we go bold? Let's go bold. That's not horrible. And then we could do like... Nice trees. You know? Could easily do like a little garden path. Do you have like tiles walking up? Dude, you can't do like little tiles going up to the house? Look into furnish mode. You have a oh wait, you could you could make yourself a garage. Oh yeah, it has to be. The RV at the side of the house has to be. Okay, I don't, know, I don't know what that does then. Accessories, garage storage, vehicles. Oh! Tables, chairs, sofa, living, bedroom, room decor, like pictures and stuff, yeah. Entertainment, TVs and stuff, yeah. Retro game console, what about modern? Outdoor. You got exterior benches, you have furniture outside for like the patio. Accessories, like a street trash can, something like that. So my mailbox would be that way. That's a modern mailbox. Outdoor decor. I just want a giant, I just want a giant fountain. Oh, statues here. Be really extra. Campfire on the side. That'd be kind of cool. Outdoor lamps. See, I, I just want some tiles. Can I do tiles? Oh, there it is. Path tool. Okay, there it is. I like this. Cemented stone. I mean, I'd have to, I'd obviously have to mess around with it a little bit, but, like, that's not horrible. Oh, look at that one. That was nice. That's not horrible. Not bad for a 15-minute quick build, but... Not too bad at all. All right, folks. Thank you so much for joining me for the Indie Buffet. I hope you guys get a chance to come in here and build your own dream homes. I'm probably going to be hopping this in on, on stream later on and 
and try to build myself an actual home. <laughs> like take some time and enjoy it. So hope you guys enjoy it. Thank you so much for joining me for the Indie Buffet. We're help you find your next favorite indie. Peace.